welcome to Aviator Nights. The biggest thing in the news at the moment, Simon Cowell is taking X Factor to the Yanks. See how they're going to cope with it. He's also offering £5 million as a contract. Now, what would you do with that money? We're going to find out what the students will do and also whether they've got the vocals to back it up. I'm already regretting this one. Dance floor, now. This week we're asking um, what you would do with, with the whole X Factor thing. Simon Cowell's bringing uh, X Factor over to the Yanks. He's offering five million pounds for a contract. Right? First of all, what would you do with five million quid? What would I do? What would I do? Um, well, today, only bunch. Definitely stick it on an accumulator. Yep. So on an accumulator. <laughs> It's going to happen, isn't it? It's all... Why are young people getting involved in betting? You've just got I... five million quid and you're still trying to win I on the horses. I'd probably go to Primark and get a couple of new numbers, you know, for a Saturday night or something. Primark? Uh, maybe then Primark. hear where the spoons are saying, I'm not sure. Well, but you can uh, take, you, you can give a uni student money, but you, you can't take them out of the normal habitat of just going to Primark, having the cheap drinks in the bar. I'd, I'd buy a tractor. Next fact is moving to America, all right? And if you win, if you win, you get five million pounds. What do I win? You make five million pounds. So what would you do so with five million pounds? Hey, well, I would buy a big farm and a shitload of tractors. <laughs> what, hey, bling bling tractors? No, not any kind of tractor. Massy Ferguson's and a fucking shitload of plows. So you can plow the land. You are going to be the weirdest millionaire in the world. You're going to be one of those no, eccentric no, ones. No, you invest in land and you get the returns. You got five million pounds. Five million pounds worth of land. <laughs> right with these gorgeous ladies down there. What's your names, girls? Becca and Becca. Becca and Becca. Double B's. Yeah. <laughs> I've just got cup sizes in my head now. Right. Um, so, I don't think you can get double beans. Um, right, girls, what we're doing this week is we're asking all the girls, uh, and the boys, um, basically, if you were given five million pounds for winning X Factor, what would you do it? She'd marry me. It would cost five million. No, no. Uh, you wouldn't do that. Burn. What would I you do? I would do that, but that costs about a hundred. It's your birthday day as well, isn't it? 21st. I'm 21. And all honestly, I didn't back. You didn't invest? In property. What, what? I'm like, who am I? <laughs> You've already got five million pounds, you're set for life. I would definitely invest in craft business. <laughs> craft. 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 It's all about craft. What the, the, the single cheese is. And then I'd be no, so rich. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Craft. Yeah, they start off with single cheese. Gonna give me my million. Your voices are. I mean, if if like sort of Simon Cowell like sort of came out to you and said, right, I want you to sing a song. You've got to go. You got the X Factor. Try it now. Try it now. What are you gonna sing? I could stay away. Just a stay away. Why you are sleeping? Well, okay, this has gone horribly wrong. Have you ever been to Battersea Dogs Home? Because if you haven't, this is a perfect reenactment. Right, we're halfway through the night and uh, everyone's going crazy inside, outside, everywhere. So uh, let's see what's happening on the dance floor. Thank you. 
Dante! Dante! Oscar! And Oscar, Hello. possibly the poshest bloke names in the world. Middle class. Middle class. Middle class. Middle class. Middle class. Middle class. But will yeah. he be in a movie? Yeah. He wants to be in a movie. Yeah. Hello. Hi, Mum. I'm sorry he wants to be in this one rather than Crime Watch later. That'd be... <laughs> no, that'd be a mishap, wouldn't it? I it hope that doesn't mishap. happen tonight. Right, lads, what we're asking this week is basically, if you're to win X Factor, you'd get five million pounds, right? Right, yeah. right? What would you do with five million quid? Um, I want to be in a movie! <laughs> None of that, mate. I'm too good for a movie after that. I'd probably be in a uh, cartoon movie! No, I don't know. Um, Buy a sports car, buy a house, house for my mum, go on holiday to Australia. That's me sorted. Oh, done. Done and done. Good fellows. <laughs> Good night. Right, we're done here with the lads. What's your names, guys? Tom. Tom. Damien. And Damien. You're not too happy because you were edited out of last week's clip, weren't you? Yeah. Crew, yeah. mate, we're fuming. We're fuming. For shame. For shame. Right, so lads, what we're doing is we're asking this week. Uh, Simon Cowell is moving uh, X Factor over to America, right? And the winner gets a £5 million contract. What would you buy? More than four. All right, what would you do with five million pounds? I'd marry Tom. Well, sing that's an expensive wedding. Well, I'd treat him well, you know? Well, he would, he would, sir. He's a nice guy. He'd really, like, he'd look after me, like. Yeah? You're invited as well, so. Ah. Oh. Can I? Plus one. He, he wants to get the cameraman. Let's go, yeah. Oh. Cameraman's cruising to the way he, He's not going to film the honeymoon, though. That's, that's, that'll be some weird shit, man. Be, mate, like I said, I dominate him, so. What? What? <laughs> what about you, Dante, mate? Five million. Five million. Five million. Right, it's, it's just before just before six, after four. I'll adopt these two. You do what? I'll adopt these two as my children. Okay. Oh, they do. Buy a What? Two and a half million each? You've been robbed, mate. No, 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 no. That was a tenner for starters. Tenner, tenner. And then I'll go to Amsterdam and fucking spend it all in the red light district. <laughs> right, we're down here with these lads here. This is, which one's Dan, which one's Tim? Dan. Tim. Tim, right, so guys, we're asking this week, uh, with X Factor being moved to uh, America, some cows taking over there, the winner gets five million pounds. What would you do with five million quid? Car your women. Boots, boots. See, now that's an answer! Not this investing, bollocks. Investing in the future. Bro it all. Three weeks. Good man. That's what I want to see. What about you, man? Ah, uh, the best in the future. <laughs> <laughs> Always run. Right, that's all from us down here. Make sure you join us next week for a very special Valentine's Day episode of Aviator Nights. Take care. Until then, bye-bye.